Assalamu alaikum everyone. In this video lecture, we will be discussing the AS level biology paper pattern. So as you all know that AS is the first year of your A levels and the full form of AS level is the advanced subsidiary level. So as far as biology is concerned, so for AS level biology, you need to appear for three papers. These are paper one, paper two, and paper three. Let's discuss each paper one by one. So if we talk about paper one, paper one is a multiple choice question paper or we can say MCQ paper. This paper has 40 multiple choice questions or MCQs, which are four optioned MCQs. That means that each MCQ has four options, A, B, C, and D. And out of the four options, one option is right that you have to choose. So each MCQ is of one mark and there are a total of 40 MCQs. This means that the total marks will be 40. There is no choice. That means you have to attempt all the MCQs. So while solving this paper, always remember this point that don't leave any MCQ. Even if you don't know the answer, just mark it on your own. Because if you mark the answer, it might get correct. It's of no use leaving any MCQ. Okay. The time duration for this paper is one hour, 15 minutes, or we can say 75 minutes altogether. So the practice should be to attempt this paper in one hour and 15 minutes should be kept for rechecking the paper. The questions that you get in the MCQ paper are based on AS level syllabus content. You don't have to touch the A2 or A level syllabus content for this paper. This paper will only test the AS level syllabus content. Let's move on to the paper two. Paper two is also known as AS level structured questions. So basically this is a theory paper which contains structured questions that are short questions. So you have total of six structured questions in this paper with no choice. That means you have to attempt all the questions and each question has variable mark value. This means that each question has different marks. For example, one question can be of eight marks. One question can be of 10 marks. One question can be of six marks. One question can be of 14 marks. So there is variable mark value. The time duration for this paper is one hour, 15 minutes and the total marks for this paper are 60 and the questions that you get in this paper are based on AS level syllabus content. Okay, let's move on to the next paper that is paper three. Paper three is known as the advanced practical skills. So in this paper, you have to go to the lab and you have to do some practical work and after you do the practical work, so there will be some questions regarding that practical work that you did. So in this paper, there is a practical work that you need to do. For example, you need to look at different tissues under the microscope and you have to deal with some solutions. So that is the practical work that are the examples of some practical work that you have to do. And then you have to solve the structured questions which are on the paper. And these structured questions will be related to your practical work that you will do. So there are two questions. One question includes microscopy, the use of a microscope. And the other question includes a wet practical. That is the practical which involves solutions. For example, the sucrose solution or the Benedict solution right and what are the total marks of this paper the total marks are 40 and time duration for this paper is two hours that is 120 minutes so time duration is two hours that is actually uh, more than the time duration of other papers that we discussed that's because you have to do the practical work and that takes time so uh, the most important thing about this paper is that the context of the questions may be outside the syllabus content. So you might get some practicals that are not in your syllabus. But don't worry, 
you will be given some information about it and then you have to answer the questions accordingly okay if we talk about the weightage of all the papers in your as level result so paper 1 has the weightage of 31 percent out of 100 paper 2 has a weightage of 46 percent and paper 3 has the weightage of 23 percent so this makes up total of 100 percent as you can see that paper 2 is the most important paper because this paper has the highest weightage so in order to achieve an a an as level you need to score very well in paper 2 you should know that the maximum grade in as level is a there is no a star in the as level okay let's discuss the topics that we need to cover in the as level biology so there are a total of 11 topics these are cell structure biological molecules enzymes cell membrane and transport mitotic cell cycle nucleic acids and protein synthesis transport in plants transport in mammals gas exchange infectious diseases and immunity okay guys so i hope everything is clear to you thank you so much for watching don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel allah is everyone